Welcome to Core Health with Todd Smith. Mike Randolph here, coming to you directly from the far northeastern shores of the Bula Vida Nation, right here in southern New Hampshire. Before we turn the controls over to Todd, I'd like to remind everyone that he'll be discussing various health and wellness topics, including Bula Vida products and their interaction with your body's natural processes. Please be aware that Bulavita's products are not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease, nor should they be used as a substitute for any medications that you may currently be using. Today's presentation is for informational purposes only. Please consult with your medical professional before starting, stopping, or adjusting any medications. With that, let's turn this presentation over to our co-founder, Mr. Todd Smith. Not only is he a health and wellness advocate, he's a 20-plus year veteran of our industry and a seven-figure income earner. He's also a family man, which in this case means a father of eight girls. And most importantly, he's the man that wants to show you a better way to bolster your good health and boost anything that you may be currently doing to improve your health. So let's go ahead and turn this over without further ado to our co-founder, Mr. Todd Smith. Todd, the screen's on you. I see your boosted shirt. Take it away. All right. Can you hear me all right? Crystal clear, five by five. Fantastic. Well, thank you for that introduction. I'm so excited to be with everybody tonight. Uh, I uh, don't normally get the opportunity to be uh, the presenter on our uh, Monday night wellness core health webinar, so I'm excited for that privilege and that opportunity. Thanks to all of you who both on the live and those who might catch us on the replay. Um, but I am so excited about being able to share some of the exciting news that's happening at Bula Vida. And as you can see by the shirt, I'm geared up to boost it, as, uh, as Mr. Randolph said, and excited to share some of this with you. So I'm gonna quickly share my screen here and uh, bring up my presentation if I can. All right, Mr. Randolph, a little confirmation that you can see the presentation. We've got the presentation, and more importantly, we've got you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Excellent. I, uh, I have a tendency to get going only to find out that nobody's seeing what I'm seeing, so I want to do a little double check. Well, uh, here at Bula Vida, we are striving to make sure that we bring you only the best. And those of you who have been with us for a few years now um, understand that when we say the best, we mean it. And uh, our president has told us that there's big stuff happening, big stuff coming. And uh, boy, did we deliver uh, in not just too long ago, about a week and some days ago, uh, that, uh, that we introduced the M20. And so tonight, I'm gonna share a little bit more information about that and share a few of my perspectives with regards to what this product means, uh, both as a health addition as well as a financial edition. Those of you who, uh, who don't know, I've been in the industry since 1996. I've got over two decades in the health and wellness industry, also in the network marketing industry. Um, you know, one of the things that I can say about being in that long is I've done some things that have worked and I've done some things that have not worked. And with that comes a little bit of experience and perhaps a little bit of wisdom. And one of the things that I just want to stress at the outset, and I'll come back full circle at the end, is what an amazing opportunity this provides for us. So with that as an intro, let's go ahead and jump in. And I just want to preface the presentation tonight, if I can move my camera around, with this right here. What single thing can a person do to boost their body's ability to protect repair and rebuild itself? Can you think of a single thing that a person could do? Is there a food or a supplement available that has been clinically proven to boost overall health? Okay, notice the bold words here. What if I told you that the most powerful superfood in the world has been hiding in the woods of North Carolina or on the coast of North Carolina for, for the last 400 plus years? And this amazing superfood has been hiding until a visionary, Jerry Smith and Brock Agee, with the help of Wake Forest University and a $20 million donation, which allowed a clinical research study to bring this secret superfood to light. That's what we're looking at and what we're talking about here tonight. 
and Bula Vida is bringing this to the world. So that's the preface. We'll get back to that. But let's talk for a second about what we have been doing at Bula Vida for since the inception, and that is we have been sounding the alarm, sounding the alarm that people are suffering and that there's something that could be done about it. From 1990 to today, we've had an alarming increase of disease. We've talked about this, but folks, this is shocking stuff and something we need to be aware of. From the 1990s today, we had a 41% increase in deaths from heart disease. Not a brand new disease, a disease that's been with us for a very, very long time, but just in the last two decades, a 41% increase, a 45% increase in asthma, 50% increase in digestive problems, 50% increase in food allergies, a 2.5 times increase or 250% increase in the disease called epilepsy. How about three times as many or 300% increase in diabetes? a three times increase in the need for fertility treatments in order to conceive, 783% increase in deaths due to Alzheimer's and 4,200% increase in autism. Now, these numbers are huge. This increase of disease is, is unmatched. These are the deadliest decades America has ever seen when it comes to chronic disease. Folks, why is this happening? What's triggering this? What on earth can we change? What on earth can we do in order to counter what's happening all around us? And that's what, that's what Bula Vida is all about. All of this has occurred despite the fact that we have continued to outspend the rest of the world. We continue to spend more and more and more on healthcare, more and more on testing, more and more on medications, more and more on treatments, more and more on hospital stays. And yet we are out, not only are we outpacing in the amount we spend, but we're outpacing the rest of the world in the occurrence of these life altering, life changing and deadly diseases. So what's the cause? Is it because of the junk food? Is it because of our sedentary lives? Is it because of the pollution in the air and the water and the food we eat? Is it because of the increase of prescription drugs, immunizations? How about the massive amounts of chemicals we're being bombarded with? The herbicides and the pesticides that are on our crops. How about the genetically modified foods that we're now getting and digesting and then finding in our food supply, et cetera, et cetera. Folks, the truth of the matter is, is that we are under an environmental assault. Uh, this is an interesting study, the body burden study, okay? The researchers analyzed the umbilical cord blood from 10 babies born in 2004 in U.S. hospitals. They 187 industrial chemicals were found in the blood with an average of 200 per child. Of those 287 chemicals we detected in umbilical cord blood, we know that 180 of them cause cancer in humans and animals. 217 are toxic to the brain and nervous system and 208 cause birth defects or abnormal development in animal tests. Folks, this is at the core and the crux of what's happening. We gave a whole bunch of examples here. Guess what? I think every single one of those contributes. But the end result is that our blood, our bodies, our environment, everything around us is being tainted and our bodies are being bombarded. And we are dying as a result of our modern life. We're being exposed to hundreds of toxic chemicals every day that our bodies have a system to get rid of, but we're so inundated and overburdened that our bodies can't get rid of them as fast as they are being put in. This is creating massive inflammation throughout the body. Those of you who study health at all know that inflammation is the silent killer that's affecting every part of our body. And that if we don't bring the inflammation down, it bungs up the system. Body can't communicate. It can't move nutrients where it needs to be. And that congestion, right, just like traffic jam, is what, is what causes disease. And so we have to bring that down. Digestive problems are rampant. The food we're eating doesn't have the nutrients and we're having a harder and harder time digesting it and getting the nutrients out of it. And so we end up deficient, deficient in essential nutrients because of all these reasons. So this rising tide, notice the acronym T-I-D-E, this rising tide of disease is something that has to be turned. And we have to give our body tools 
so that it can do this, so that it can overcome this massive overload of toxins, this, this reaction of inflammation, the effect and negative comprom compromising digestive system, and the absolute lack of absorbable nutrition. This is what we have to address. And, and as a result of this, our body is becoming inundated with free radical damage. This is oxidative. This is rustiness, rust that's occurring in our body. Our cells, our tissues are oxidizing and they're creating these free radicals that are flying all over like bullets that are, that are blasting holes right through the cells of our body. And the healthy cells then become unhealthy. And as unhealthy cells, because of this free radical damage start to replicate, we end up with mutated cells and then we end up with things like cancer and all sorts of disease that are the result of oxidative damage tearing up our healthy cells. So as our bodies age, we lose our ability to fight these effects of free radicals. The chemicals and things we're exposed to create massive uh, increase in the amount of free radicals in our system, more and more oxidative stress and more and more damaged cells. What can we do about it? Well, folks, just 10 days or so ago, we introduced a product um, that is from nature. It's America's premier superfood. It's something you've probably never heard of, or if you did, you had no idea what it, the value was inside of this little sweet baby here you see on the screen called a muscadine grape. Now look at it closely. You'll see there's little dots on it, little scars on it. And one of the things that, uh, that I learned the first time that I went to the vineyards and to the processing plant in North Carolina and looked at these things and got to try them and eat them and drink the juice and, and learn all about these, listen to the doctors and the experts talk about it, is I learned that the most ugly looking ones are the healthiest. Isn't that interesting? In fact, Jerry Smith, uh, the uh, visionary here said, when you pick your grape, everybody picks the pretty bright, colorful, you know, pristine ones. He says, what you want are the ones that are all scarred up and beat up because the muscadine grape has a natural ability to protect itself. And when it goes through hard times, when it is inundated by viruses and fungus and molds and, and pestis, you know, pests and all sorts of things like that, it, it, it creates a natural immune response and it raises up its polyphenols, it raises up its phenolics, it raises up its bioflavonoids, all of these things that we know are so beneficial for our health. And so the scarred grapes are the ones that have the, the most health benefit. They have the highest phenolic count. So one of the things is you look at these grapes, you say, well, those don't look as good as my table grape. And you're right because these particular grapes have the ability to fend for themselves. You don't use herbicides, you don't use pesticides, you don't have to worry about the insects, you don't have to worry about the molds and the fungus and the viruses because the grape actually fights itself. And then when we consume the grape, all of those, all of those immune response uh, nutrients that the grape has produced to protect itself, our body gets the benefit. So let's talk a little bit about this amazing, amazing plant that has been right under our noses for over 400 years. The mother vine of this plant has been found in the outer banks of North Carolina. You can see it right there. This thing is 400 years old and still producing fruit. Okay, it's believed to be planted maybe by the Croatians or some other, some other group that, uh, that later became known as Native Americans. The first record of the vine is found in the writings of an expedition in 1584. If you remember the whole 1494 with uh, Columbus, that gives you kind of a bearing as to when this happened. The muscadine grape is America's premier superfood, but folks, people don't know about it. You, if you'd even known about it, if you grew up in the area, you'd, you'd know a little bit about it because it grew naturally and it occurred out there and maybe you've even tried it, but you had no idea what was going on inside that grape and the benefits that are available to all of us. See, these muscadine grapes have two more chromosomes than wine or table grapes. This provides this greater genetic ability to rebuild and build health. Unlike other fruits or berries, the muscadine has the ability to resist mold, bacteria, viruses without the use of chemicals. And, and they also, the way they grow is that they're able to now grow in, a, in, uh, in the hot, humid climate of the Southeast. Due to their extra set of chromosomes, they can flourish in locations that traditional grapes truly struggle. And that's how we get such powerful, powerful fruit uh, with all these phytochemicals. 
So here's the question, is it a grape or is it a berry? Well, they call it a grape, muscadine grape. However, technically, if you look at it chemically, it actually is closer to a berry than it is to a grape because it has all the health benefits of a grape. But check this chart out. It also has all of the health benefits that you'd find in a berry. And some of these berries you say, oh, well, you know, the blueberry and the pomegranate, these are acai, goji, these are amazing amazing fruits, amazing berries with amazing phytochemicals and health benefits. The amazing thing about the muscadine is it has everything and more that the, that the regular grape has, all the wonderful things about OPCs and, and the uh, <clears throat> resveratrol, and you can go on and on with all of the benefits there. It also has everything that the berries have. You can see them here, the elagic acid, the flavonoids, resveratrol, quercetin, gallic acid, anthocyanids, OPCs, catechins. Folks, this is an amazing superfood. And check out this chart. You want to know, you want to know how many antioxidants are in this. This ORAC scale stands for oxygen radical absorbance capacity. Now that's the ability of a food to, to dissipate or absorb uh, free radicals. So it's, it's a test run by Brunswick Laboratories. It was originally instituted by the National Institutes of Health. And it's for us to truly analyze and identify what foods, particularly fruits and vegetables, can help in fighting off free radical and oxidative stress and damage. And that in that test, not done by us, not done by anybody related to us, by a third party Brunswick Laboratory comparing the oxygen radical absorbance capacity of grapes, goji, mangosteen, acai, cranberry, blueberry, pomegranate, apple, noni juice, the list would go on and on. The muscadine seed just annihilates them as far as the percentage. And you can see why. It's because of this amazing genetic capacity uh, with the extra chromosomes. So our founder and visionary, Jerry Smith, he actually uh, was the one that had a personal health benefit from these grapes. And he said, there's something here. And he shared them with a friend. Okay. He shared them with a friend who was very, very sick. This friend was very, very wealthy, had access to everything the medical community had to provide. And, and he could not get better until he added the, uh, the M20 and the muscadine grape. And when he added the muscadine grape, he got so better. He said, the whole world needs to hear this. And so he, he donated $20 million. He's an anonymous donor, right? He donated $20 million for clinical studies to be able to support, understand, and, uh, and give backup for what we're telling you about this muscadine grape. So here's a list of uh, amazing benefits of antioxidants, all these different antioxidants listed on one side. And then you can see in the little bubbles or circles over there, some of the things that antioxidants have been shown to do. I'm not making any claims here except to tell you that this is not, this is science uh, according to antioxidants in general, that these are extremely beneficial for health. They affect every part of health because they reduce inflammation, because they boost immune response, because they help the body's reaction to toxins and detox and eliminate these things from the body. You can imagine if the body is, is, is boosted to where it can get rid of toxins, to where it can get rid of of uh, inflammation to where it can uh, improve digestion, all of these things. You can imagine why basically everything that a person could suffer from health-wise can be improved and boosted by, by uh, giving the body these antioxidants. And so that's the whole process. Here's another study, an article written about how muscadine increased uh, brachial arteries, so cardiovascular health. This is a, this $20 million research that I mentioned. This is study analyzing the effects of the muscadine grape on cancer patients and multiple forms of cancer, both in how they recover and how they handle treatment, et cetera, et cetera. And there's lots of, they've already been through phase one and phase two. They're now entering phase three of these clinical studies on the effects of muscadine grape supplementation um, is particularly with the skins and seeds with regards to these diseases. Another active ingredient that's very prevalent in this is one called quercetin. It's a potent anti-inflammatory antiviral substance found in certain foods, particularly red onions and apples, but even more so in a higher potency and a higher level in the muscadine grape. 
Uh, many people take this in the fall or the spring to help with allergies to tree and weed pollen. Lately, it's been looking into its powerful ability to fight against uh, different viruses. Um, it's been shown in many studies to have a fairly broad antiviral properties against these viruses. There was a study done at the Appalachian State University where they wanted to know how does how do this, uh, this nutrient quercetin help with reducing illness in physically stressed athletes? Um, they gave this quercetin nutrient to uh, these athletes who were, who were riding their bikes and going through all of this um, to find out how they would be susceptible. 20 cyclists ingested the quercetin, 1,000 um, <clears throat> milligrams a day for five weeks, placebo to the other 20. They rode for three hours. Um, Stress weakens the immune system, increase infections rate. Here you go, 45% of the cyclists that were on the placebo reported illness, 5% of the cyclists on the quercetin reported illness. So they proved by this study that the supplementation of the quercetin as opposed to a placebo uh, improved, improved the body's ability under stress to be able to fight off illness. So here is a picture of Jerry Smith, our visionary. And when he experienced for himself what the muscadine could do, uh, he, he said, we got to get this out there. He said, when I saw what the muscadine did for me, I told my staff, we can help a lot of people. And so that's what he started to do. You see here pictures of the vineyards. These are the vineyards that, uh, that Jerry has uh, fostered and, and nurtured and taken care of. Um, we're looking forward in August to be able to take a, a, a group of select of our family, our Bula Vida family, to go and see these, experience these themselves. The grapes will be ready for harvest. You'll be able to pick those muscadines right off the vine uh, and try them. Uh, we're excited uh, for this privilege and this opportunity. It's, it was it was uh, back in the last fall that, uh, that President Bill Andrioli, Blake Graham, and myself went and experienced this. And we're so excited to share this experience with our Bula Vida family. Uh, he's put together the ability to harvest these. Uh, I loved the way Brock described this. They tickle the grapes right off the vine, um, and then they process them. And, uh, and then they've got this $35 million uh, facility where they, uh, they exclusively manufacture and process the muscadine grape. Uh, we'll get to take a tour there and show everybody. And because it'll be harvest time, you'll be able to drink fresh squeezed muscadine grape juice right off of the, uh, of the juicer. And uh, so this will be a great experience uh, that nobody in this family are gonna wanna miss. Um, and, and you will not be able to go on this experience and come away and say, eh, I don't know. This, this will lock everybody in, it did for me. Um, because when I saw when I saw the extent that Jerry Smith has done to put all of this infrastructure together to to process and maintain the purity of the phytonutrients and chemicals that are found in this amazing fruit and uh, and with all of the investment that's already been paid for that's already there with 750 million dollars of marketable finished product available, folks, this is an this is an opportunity uh, to one change so many people's health and improve so many people's lives. But it's also an opportunity for business because this is an opportunity to, to truly um, set ourselves up in front of a huge, huge uh, market and a huge uh, growth curve because everything's put in place. All we have to do now is tell people about it. All we have to do is, is take this amazing story, these amazing products to the world. And so that is what we have done recently. We introduced this M20 boost, M20 for the, uh, the extra chromosomes, um, muscadine for the, you know, M for the muscadine. And it's, it's uh, literally the skins and the seeds preserved in these capsules. Um, it provides core health and wellness every day. It's known to reduce oxidative stress, revitalize energy levels, boost cardiovascular health, increase blood flow, improve brain function, support immune system, promote joint health, support sexual health, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, because what this does is it boosts your health. And, and we've put this, this M20 boost combined with our amazing pink Fijian, organic pink Fijian ginger and our uh, Fijian, organic Fijian turmeric, these three become the trifecta of superfoods. You already know, those of you who have been with us, you already know the amazing health benefits of our organic pink Fijian ginger. You already know the amazing health benefits of our Fijian, organic Fijian turmeric. You already know what these have done for you and for so many of your family members and friends. Folks, when we add M20 to it, the whole thing gets boosted. 
And that's why we say boost it. You know, if, it, if you're talking about your, your immune system, we want to boost it. If you're talking about your joint health, we want to boost it. If you're talking about your ability to lose weight, we want to boost it. If you're talking about energy levels, we want to boost it. If you're talking about, you know, protection against, against harmful uh, viruses or bacteria or pathogens, we want to boost it. If we want to talk about income, we want to boost it. This, this right here is exactly what this opportunity is all about. It's an opportunity with this trifecta of superfoods. Nowhere else can you find this. Uh, you have an opportunity to put yourself in a place to truly boost everyone's health and boost everyone's finances as well. So I started out with what single thing can a person do to boost their body's ability to protect, repair, and rebuild itself? Is there a food or supplement available that has been clinically proven $20 million of research to boost overall health. If someone says, well, I don't know if it works. Well, I got $20 million of research to say that it does. What if I told you that the most powerful superfood in the world has been hiding in the woods and the shores of North Carolina for the last 400 years? This amazing superfood has been hiding until Jerry Smith and Brock Agee with the help of Wake Forest University and $20 million clinical research have brought this secret superfood to light. And folks, we, are going to take it to the world. And this is where I wanna take just a second and share a little bit of my perspective because I told you I've been in the industry for over two decades. Um, I've been very, very blessed and very fortunate to be in front of and take part in some great growth curves, um, both from a standpoint of helping literally tens of thousands, if not hundreds of thousands with their health. I've also been able to help that many with their finances as well. And uh, I, I don't take credit for it, I've been able to position myself in front of uh, timing, in front of, in front of growth curves. I've been able to catch waves of growth. And one of the things that I want you to do right now is if you're a business person, I want you to stop for just a second. I want you to think, wow, there have been a whole bunch of superfoods introduced to the market. Some of them you might've even heard of. They were on that graph, right? Noni juice, perhaps you've heard of it. Perhaps you've heard of mangosteen. Perhaps you've heard of acai. Perhaps you've heard of goji berry, and I could go on and on. There's a whole list of these different superfoods that have been introduced over the years and over just the years that I've been in the industry. And I have watched each one of these see incredible growth. Some of them reaching literally hundreds of millions, if not billions of dollars in sales per year. And those people who recognize those opportunities, those people who grabbed it and started sharing it with people, not only did they see incredible changes in their health, not only did they uh, help other people with their health, but they also saw incredible increases in their, in their ability to produce income, creating huge residual incomes as a result of latching themselves on and positioning themselves in front of the marketing and distribution of a brand new product to the marketplace. Now, I tell you that to say, folks, this one, the muscadine, it creams all of them. Let me go back to that graph. I'm going to show you right here again. Look at that graph. Okay. I mentioned some of these. There's, there's companies on the market still selling these. And ours is many, many, many times more potent, more powerful. And guess what? All of the work has been done, okay? The research. None of those others that I talked about had $20 million of clinical research on animals and humans to back up the claims. None of them, yet they became $100 million plus companies. None of them had the, the power of the auric, the phytonutrients, the phenolics, the bioflavonoids. None of them compare from a health standpoint to the muscadine grape. None of them were manufactured and made right here in the USA with already paid for manufacturing facilities, vineyards that are already produced, growing, locked up, and you have the ability to go, go there yourself, walk the vineyard, put, pick the grapes, eat them, put them in your mouth, go to the manufacturing facility, kick the tires, see exactly how it's made. None of those other companies had that. Folks, we are positioned in a place, I hope some of you recognize that right now is a very unique time for you to be able to take advantage of something that is so powerful for your health at a time where there, people are walking scared. I mean, you can look at the statistics with, with, with what's going on. Entire economies have been shut down worldwide. 
because of this virus. And we have something that will help boost our body's ability to fight. And, and we have access to this. And we, nobody's heard about it. $20 million of research behind it, and nobody knows about it. And they're only going to find out about it through you. So that's, that's all I had for you tonight. I hope this has piqued some interest. Um, please share this with the people you care about. Share it with your family members, your friends, your neighbors, people you go to church with. Let them know that this secret has been brought to light. This secret superfood has been brought to light in the M20 boost. And I don't care what you're doing to improve your health. I don't care what it is, we can boost it. That's the power of this. That trifecta of superfoods will boost whatever people are doing. So there's nobody that can say, well, I've already got my products or I already take my supplements or I already have my exercise program or I already take my prescription. I already have a program with my doctor. It doesn't matter. Whatever it is they're doing, we can boost it. And we can boost it to where they feel the difference. And that's the amazing thing about this M20, the Fijian, uh, pink Fijian ginger and the Fijian turmeric. This trifecta, is changing lives and we're so excited to be able to bring it to you. So with that, I'll bring this to a close, Mr. Randolph, and pass it back to you. Well, nothing, certainly nothing I can add. I'll just uh, actually get us ready to, uh, to close out. Just put that little bit of information on the screen as we, uh, as we close up. Wonderful job, Todd. Thank you so much for sharing. Um, boost it. I don't know what else to say. We'll see you guys again uh, in a few more webinars this week. Don't forget tomorrow, 9 a.m., Monday through Friday, the Health, Wealth, and Time Freedom Call, where we share amazing personal stories about what these products have done for folks. Take care, everybody.